Welcome to the Old Timer Centre. My name is Philip Tarrant and I'm going to be talking to you about this 2014 Jaguar XF. It's the four cylinder turbo diesel and it's black with light grey leather interior and the absolutely beautiful timber. It's actually quite nice to see a Jaguar with a bit of timber in it as piano black chrome and silver are becoming more and more popular as far as I'm concerned if it's a Jaguar it should have plenty of timber like this car does it's only done 44,000 kilometers which is absolutely nothing for any car especially a turbo diesel it's a premium luxury it's got reverse camera navigation Bluetooth electric seats drivers and passenger side a sunroof and parking sensors so it's been uh, optioned very well I really love the color combination we are located quite literally moments to Sydney Airport which is why I can hear the plane flying over and just the attention to detail, even the stitching along the top of the door here is certainly very nice. The leather is in excellent condition. It's been serviced up to date. It's got two keys. And you can tell if it's a 2014 build and compliance because the uh, 2014 models generally got these red Jaguar centre caps. It's got keyless entry. Keyless start, obviously. So if you have the keys on you and you want to lock the door, you just press that button. It does have a very good size boot. It does have the parking sensors as well as the reverse camera. It's got tinted windows, which has probably helped keep the interior in particularly good condition. You may have seen the car just unlocked when I approached it and put my hand on the handle. But it certainly is very impressive. Ice cold air conditioning. And just a very, very nice colour combination. I'm surprised more people didn't opt to get the, uh, the Burl Timber. I'm certainly very impressed with this vehicle. Excellent condition, very low kilometres, great colour combination, economical and reliable diesel engine. Uh, it's also got Xenon headlights, daytime running lights, parking sensors front and rear. And I think for, for this amount of money, it's a very good buying indeed. It's also rear wheel drive which for me is pretty important. You know, you know, there's a few manufacturers, Volkswagen, Audi, making front-wheel drives. There's only one reason. They don't in any way drive better. There's not a better weight distribution. They're just cheaper to make. And fuel consumption is a little bit less. But you've got your engine in the front, your gearbox in the front, driven wheels at the front. It's not great. Whereas a car like this, your driven wheels are at the back. Your gearbox is normally towards the centre and your engine in the front so you've got a pretty good weight ratio and they're just much nicer cars to drive but if you do have any specific questions about this car you can contact us on 02956999999 we are the old timer centre we've been doing this for over 20 years and we specialise in European cars just like this one Thanks, time. Thanks for uh, taking the time to watch this video. We certainly look forward to hearing from you soon.